Good afternoon, everyone. Yep, definitely afternoon. So I'm coming to you from the lovely floor of my hostel in Sydney because I'm here for RTX this weekend. Finally made it. I had a whole intro and everything filmed this morning and then I deleted it while I was in the train accidentally. So I caught a train here and now I'm here and I made it to the hostel. I am the first one here. I think everyone else is about five or 10 minutes away. So hopefully we're gonna go meet up with them and get some food because I haven't eaten today and yeah. It should be fun. I'm here for RTX, which is the Rooster Teeth convention, and it runs on Saturday and Sunday, and it's Thursday right now. Oh yeah, it's Thursday, the 1st of February. Happy first day of Edith. I'm gonna bring you along to the convention with me. I'm volunteering this year. I'm on the one of the stages, so I'm doing stage management, which I've done for the last two years in a row as well. So it's gonna be fun. I'm really excited, like super excited. And yeah, that's pretty much what I'm doing here this weekend. I'm here till I think Monday or Tuesday, so it'll be a bit of a while, but yeah, I'm really excited and I'm gonna bring you guys along, so we'll see you there. Good morning, everyone. Sorry, it's a bit noisy. I'm outside at a cafe, but I am terrible at vlogging uh, and I haven't done anything, so that's fun. Um, today is day two. Today is setup day, so we're going in at about 12 to sort of have our briefings and everything. I'm waiting for the bus to leave. So we go in and we set up today and we learn what our jobs are, get our safety briefings and all that sort of stuff. And then we're gonna get some lunch and that's pretty much it. I still haven't told everyone about the fact that I'm vlogging yet. So hopefully I'll be able to vlog a little bit more today. And yeah, see you then. RTX. Um, I severely overestimated how much time I was gonna have to vlog the convention. Um, I had no time at all. I think I ended up walking the sh like the convention floor for about an hour, if that. Probably not even an hour. I was so busy the entire time, but it was a bunch of fun. I had so much fun seeing all the friends that I made last year and the year before, and meeting new friends this year, and just working on the stages. Seeing the RTS staff was eh. They have things to do. But yeah, it was just a whole lot of fun. Um, definitely incredibly sad to be back and experiencing those post-con blues because now I have to return to real life, which I don't want to do. My highlight of RTX, I think, would probably have to be <laughs> 
we were backstage and it was uh, we were preparing for the on the spot panel on a Sunday and Patrick Salazar who does all the podcasts and stuff in Austin he was there as well and he was setting up all of the, the visuals and stuff like the score and everything for on the spot so he was backstage like getting his stuff all set up and he turns around to us and he was just like hey guys do you want a photo with the golden gus and we were like um yes like we're not gonna say no to that and as a guardian when they select you to be a guardian they make it very clear that they expect you to be professional the entire time that you're on shift which is absolutely fair so we generally don't talk to the rt staff unless we have to and we weren't allowed to get photos in our guardian shirts with the rt staff again totally fair but patrick turned around and was like do you guys want to get a photo with the golden gus and because he asked us about it we were allowed to so we got a photo and it was just like, it was just the greatest thing that happened this convention and I had such a good time with it. And Patrick was so lovely. He was probably one of the only staff that actually kind of walked out, like when he was leaving, he walked out and was like, thank you guys for all your hard work. You did a really great job. And that was just really nice to know that they understand how much effort goes into taking a lot of time out of our personal schedules to volunteer for their convention, which was really, really nice. Um, I think Patrick is just a lovely human. And yeah, that was the highlight of my RTX was probably meeting Patrick Salazar. So thanks, Pat. You're pretty great. But yeah, that was pretty much RTX for me. We did a lot of other fun stuff. I went shopping a bit. Um, we went out a fair bit and I'm still very tired. As you can see, my under eye bags are ridiculous right now because um, I didn't get that much sleep over the week. But that was fun. And we had the Guardian after party, which is where everyone got really, really, really drunk. And it was a good time. And yeah, I just had a lot of fun. It's probably one of my favorite weeks of the entire year because I know that I can just leave everything behind and go to Sydney and have just such a good time with a whole bunch of really great people. And it's just, it's good. If you ever get a chance to volunteer for a convention, I highly recommend it. It is such a wonderful experience. Like if you're into conventions, that is like, if you're not into conventions then obviously don't do it. But like, I think it's just a great opportunity for you to meet other people that are as passionate about things that, as you are. And you may not have completely the same interests. Like to be honest, in the last year, I haven't watched really any Rooster Teeth content. I've just sort of kept up with some of the stuff that I enjoy, not necessarily everything that they do because that's just so much content because they're growing so much and they have so many different offsets now as well. So I didn't have a lot of relatable interests, I guess, uh, with some of the other guardians because obviously they keep up with the content and all that sort of stuff. But it's just nice knowing that these are also people who are willing to give up a week of their time and travel from like all over Australia to come and work for this convention and to, to volunteer and to contribute their time and their skills to making it all work and I think that's just amazing and I guess I have the same mindset so that's why I get along with everyone so well but yeah if you ever get a chance and you are interested I fully recommend uh, applying to be a guardian or applying to be a volunteer at any other convention. I haven't actually done any other conventions so I can't speak for how good they are but RTX is a pretty good one so if you get a chance and you want to you should definitely do it it's so much fun. But yeah that is my uh, experience this year at RTX Sydney 2018. Yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video guys, uh, however short that it was because I didn't film very much. I hope you enjoyed the video, I hope you're having a great day, and I'll see you next time. Bye!